All right, guys. Feeling here back another live stream because why the fuck not? It's one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Is that something? Um, I said fuck it. I, I want to do some left behind uh, speed runs. So I don't, know. I don't know how many people shot this. Probably almost nobody, but who cares? Um, so I'll do a couple attempts. I mean, realistically, I don't, I don't think we'll be here for that long. But, um, probably like two or three attempts. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, I hopefully I just get this first try, but yeah. Don't know if that'll happen. Or if we'll get it at all. We'll see. Ready, set, go. Hey, Menace. Yeah, again, I, I don't expect many people to show up to or like an impromptu stream at 1 a.m. in the morning. Um, but, whatever. Yeah, there's actually like stuff to talk about though in the last day. More of your brother stuff's happened. Uh, more, uh, well, I mean, I've watched more Star Quebec. I've watched the new Traders episode. So that's all something. <laughs> Fuck me, dude. Fuck this game. Um, Alright, attempt number two already at fucking two minutes in the stream. So that's great. Uh, yeah, this is really random. I, I mentioned this at the end of last stream. That I was like, I probably will end up doing more left behind attempts at some point. Uh, but yeah, I was just like, I feel like doing them now, and it's like, like, I might as well stream it. Why not? Ready, set, go. Oh, that, that was, uh, yeah, really humorous, the, uh, Cam and Red breakup. Especially because it's like, it's all under, like, it's all a misunderstanding, right? All right. <laughs> it's all like, uh, Red seeming to believe that Cameron, like, called him out as being a misogynist when, like, he didn't, even though I'm mean, right as kind of misogynist. Um, but it's like the thing that he actually like hates him for is like not a thing that actually happened. So that's kind of funny. There we go. I fuck that up this time. Um, yeah, is Jack still going home? Like, I haven't followed the feeds for the last, like, few hours or so. But, um, I'm assuming Jack's still going up. I did see that there was, like, a convert- Fuck off, game. Really? Really doing this? <laughs> uh, but I did see that there was, like, a conversation between, uh, like, Jag and Sarid, or Sarid was, like, calling him out for, like, not trusting her or whatever. Um, all right, here we go. Attempt number three. This is going great so far. Um, all right, let's try this again. <laughs> uh, let's recover to Felicia a few minutes ago. Okay, yeah, because I've also been seeing a lot of like anti America stuff too. But, um, like from Cerise's perspective, it always seemed like she was still going for Jag, but it also felt like a curious choice to just like right. tell Jag that right now. Um, like, why not wait until, like, after he's on the block or whatever, if that's really what you're, like, locked in on doing, but... Whatever, I mean... Yeah, traders at you, I don't know what the fuck they're doing. Like, this is, like, the... Like, are these the worst faithful ever? Like, the game's won, right? At this point? Like, the traders have won no matter what? Um... I guess not no matter what. I guess, like, they could technically turn on each other, right? And then there's still a chance that they lose, but... Isn't it three three at six? Um, so like it's pretty much over that a trader's gonna win. It's just a matter of like who. Um, yeah, I think this is worse because at least there they were they were being tricked by Suri. Like this is them being tricked by Sam. Thirty five right, three left. All right, 30. we're ahead by one point three. So that's worth. 
it's good. I'm enjoying it. I mean, like, I'm, I'm sure a lot of people are, like, frustrated by it, but I think it's good TV. Uh, like, I, I just, it's so funny, like, how wrong they are. Or, like, even at the beginning of the episode, when they're, like, all talking, when they're all going to the breakfast and talking about, like, who they think the traitor is, they're all wrong. It's like, how? Like, they, like all the traitors have been, like, directly called out. It's like, how are you still wrong on who the traitors are? Like, it's really mind-blowing. I just realized my timer's a bit fucked. Not that I mean, not you're seeing it anyway, but um, I forgot I changed some settings earlier. That I didn't change back, so I should probably do that after this run dies. Um, yeah, I think Sam's like a great villain. Like, is he like a likable person? Not particularly, but like, I think he's like he's good TV. And to be fair, I think he is obviously like handing up for a show to where like I think he knows how to make good TV. Well, I mean, they just recruited one. So there were like two traders. They recruited at eight, and then they voted out faithful, and then now they get the murder. Or at least that's the okay. What the fuck game? Uh, that's the assumption <laughs> that they're gonna murder. Which I don't know why they're allowing them to. Because isn't it typically? That you can't murder from seven on. Here we go. But whatever, I guess. Alright. Still minus point four. <clears throat> but yeah, if they do get to murder, like it is pretty much done. Oh, and like surprisingly it seems That's like close, huh? uh Blake has more like sus on him right now. I, yeah, I would love this season if it's a Sam one. It'll be amazing TV. Thanks. Uh, if Sam wins this season. Oh, come on. Up we go. Considering how much of a fucking train wreck. So, uh, how did you find them? The fireflies? Like his entire run's yeah. been. <laughs> Remember that firefly? My biggest bit party. Yeah, yeah, again, just started do an impromptu stream of me playing Left Behind speedruns because death. why not? I follow him into this alley and all these fireflies ambush me. They took me right to their hideout. Uh, fuck off, to Riley. Can you move? Were you scared? <laughs> Uh, dude, this is gonna be so bad. I thought this time oh, she'd fine. Me. But instead, she just says, "What took you so long?" Camille was, was giving mother. I mean, and she just um, made you a I like it, is that, like that. It'd be weird if that's what the season that is. Is that like time. the two like she original traders like take themselves me. out and it's like Camille winning? <gasps> but I wouldn't. I would also not be opposed to that either. It would essentially be a worse version of the Kate storyline, though. Or Kate, fuck me, Alex storyline uh, from last season. I love like, I get Kate and Alex. Like, I know that Kate was the other trader that joined late, but for some, some reason, I remember Alex as Kate for some reason. 30 days, my ass. People are getting infected all the time. They just do it. Oh, you missed not much. Just me fucking restarting two runs already. Uh, because I messed it up in the first uh, split. This is bad. Yeah, that, that was really bad. I lost three seconds. Just from fucking movement. Well, whatever. Cameron Red. I don't think Cam would target Red. I think Red might target Cameron, though. I don't even know who Cameron targets right now. Is it just America? Is that who we would go for? I'm saying it's stuck on a ladder or on a plank like last time. Ellie. That was the first thing I asked Marlene. She wants you safe at that stupid school. I'm not even I mean, Kate was, like, safe. pretty present on the show, yeah, right? She She's worried I'll get you into trouble. But, like, that was essentially, like, one of these instances where, like, she recruited her because she, like, knew she was going to be voted out, right? What are we doing here, Riley? I have a surprise for you. What? Is it a dinosaur? Did I ever talk about this? I did try to watch Survi or, sorry, right uh, Trader dinosaur. Spain, then realized you need to have a VPN for it. And I was like, fuck it, I don't care anymore. Um, I can't believe Winston's gone. You heard? Yeah. Do you know how it happened? Nope, I don't. Fuck that. Uh, I think it would be a better chance of faithful. Probably? Actually, I don't know. Unless he's just like... I think Alex really? pretty much had it one, right? Fuck off, game. Cool. <laughs> uh, whatever. It's fine. Ellie. 
Ellie. That was bad. Uh, I have HBO Max. I sh uh, the thing is, like, it's only available on HBO Max in Spain, which is the thing I found out. I thought it was HBO Max everywhere. Turns out it's only HBO Max in Spain, so you need to have a VPN to watch it. Um, bad. Uh, plus 2.4. Yeah, it's like at that point, it's like I don't, I don't care enough. Whatever. Um, I don't care enough to get a VPN to watch fucking uh, Trader Spain. Well, you see anything? Come Riley? On. Yeah, Ram Stream. I thought it was last night that I wouldn't be opposed to just doing a random what left behind speed run stream. I swear there's 15 people here because like, I started streaming at fucking like 1 o'clock in the morning, place. but. I got the perfect mask for you. Riley, perfect. Check it out. Put it on. Um, is everywhere it dropped? Maybe it changed the max. I, I, I searched for it and it wasn't there. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know. Bad ass. I, and then I looked it up online. Everyone. Yeah, like we were say, saying that people need like VPNs to watch it. Roar. Ellie. Really? See, I don't know. Maybe they did, Fucking like, war. take it off for some reason? I don't know. I also tried, like, a quick search to look for, uh, videos of it online. I didn't see it, there so I was like, is. whatever. It's fine. Now let's see what else this oh, place too early. Has. There we go. Yeah, this run's not good so far, but it's fine. Ah. Uh... I'm assuming it's gonna be Jag. See those cars down there? Yeah. Red one's yours. I'll be blue. Because and then, whoever breaks at that point, it's like who knows who goes on. Like obviously, like Jag is the favorite to go home now, but like they they they'll obviously change their mind a billion times before it happens. Answer a question. No sarcasm. <laughs> what is this like, truth? Like truth? really, it's like. All right, actually, no. They probably should get rid of Jag, right? Over. Over red. Like, really, the move is to get rid of America if you're Suri. Um. Oh, fuck off. Okay, cool. Bad, yeah, you like that? Fine. He's like, it's funny that, like, again, the reasons that they want to target America are not good reasons. Um. Yeah. At least, like, from, like, the Jared and them side of things. But, like, Bingo. they actually should be targeting America. Ha. Okay, as long as I don't miss. I'm gonna save time. Great. All right. Last one. Even th even if I do oh, it slow. Oh, on. fuck off! Really? Okay. Well, that's perfect. Um. Whatever. Yes. Rick. I even Bobby? saved time from that, and that was Let's terrible. My car uh, because like last time I yeah, missed whatever, once. Loser. But... All right. Question time. I'm scared. Okay. Uh, of course, I like I miss it on a shot that I was like so no confident that I was gonna hit it that I'd even bother to go back in the case no. that I did miss it. Wow. So that's that's okay. fantastic. Come on, let me show you this thing. We're almost there. Right. Oh, they're gonna change their mind a billion times. Uh, I would not be shocked if they change their mind on the noms like right before they happen. What are we doing here? So just saying, like Jared oh. seems to really want to get rid of America. You know how we thought they only towered Like the, he really seems to like not want to put put up Boy Jane at all oh, for me? some reason. It's like that get okay. What am I doing? Fuck me. <laughs> um, and then the Jag one, it's like he he's uh still keeps on mentioning that he really wants to get rid of America, but it's like the Siri and Felicia's of the so, world. It turns out that want Jag the whole out. City has power. <laughs> They just flip the circuit breakers. All you gotta do is flip it back. There's no way this is gonna work. <laughs> Alright, there we go. I didn't fuck up like last time. Yeah, that's kind of why I, I'm not like f following the strategy. As much as I feel like I typically would. Wait. Just because it feels like everything's like so flip floppy that you know like what what's do. the point? I'll just wait until tomorrow and listen to Taryn's update. I'm really glad 
that you're not dead. Uh, I have like peeked into feeds here and there though. I'm glad um, that we're back. Probably together. a bit more than I did like last I didn't season. Mean it. So it's like, it's kind of funny that I'm like, I feel like I'm watching the actual feeds a bit more, even though like, I'm actually like paying attention to like the strategy of it less. Um... Riley. Oh, uh, Jared's not getting ejected. I mean, I, I could, like I told you that yesterday. There's no way they're going to eject Jared. Should they? Yeah, probably. Um, especially based on the rules and everything. But like, will they know? Um... <laughs> Yeah, I don't get people that say this season's boring. Um, and, like, the thing is, like, so I f obviously follow Evil Dick on, on Twitter. And, like, just seeing all his posts, it's, like, it's all so negative on this season. And it's, like, I, I don't, like, get it. <laughs> um, I mean, it is Evil Dick, so it's, like, it's kind of what you would expect from him. But, like, but like still, like, like most of his comments, which, to be fair, he blocks out people that don't agree with him. But, like, still, like, most of the comments that... Uh, are like supporting his like uh idea that yeah the season sucks and it's like I, I don't oh, personally God. get it but whatever I guess um, like I can get on paper that you're thinking okay this is a Sari steamroll and everything but like again yeah the the gameplay itself is like so chaotic that um that kind of like nullifies the like boringness you would expect from a Sari steamroll. And like uh, people keep on claim, like talking about like how, um, like oh it's all been unanimous votes. It's like who cares? Like Big Brother's never been about the voting to me. Like to me, it's like again, I think that's one of the bigger differences between Survivor and and uh, Big Brother. Is that Big Brother? I think the vote matters a lot more. It's like the vote is like the big event. Where like with Big Brother, the big event is like the lead up to the vote more so than the actual vote. Um, all right, let's see how this fight goes. Bad. I only have one bullet, so this is bad. And it's not even attacking me, so that's also great. Um, okay, cool. <laughs> uh, whatever. Fine, fine, fine. It's whatever. <laughs> uh. Is that it? Come on. Sounds like it. Okay. Anytime now. Find some gas. Yeah, I lost time again, but that's <sighs> fine. Oh yeah, yeah, I saw pretty supposed too, which like Take the hose and Yeah, I I I don't I I just don't feel that way. <laughs> Um. Uh, here we go. Uh, I, I I just feel like I'm I'm still having so much fun with the season. Like I don't really care to the fact that like everyone is like, uh, essentially falling in line to Sari and everything, just because like Sari's actual decision making is, uh, what's making it so chaotic. Come on. Frustrating, but I don't find frustrating bad though like i find like if something's frustrating that means i actually care because that's why it's frustrating is because i care enough to find it frustrating which is why i'm enjoying the season of au of traders au we're like yeah it's frustrating as shit to see these like faithfuls play so terribly but it's also like riveting tv to see them play so terribly Uh, don't really like anyone on the Sari side. I like Izzy. I don't like Jared, obviously. Easy. I like Felicia. Easy. Keep looking straight. Um. Everything's gonna be fine. You're not gonna fall uh, into that it's water. Pretty much her side, right? Like Mimi's up. fine. Oh wait, I meant to pick that up. Whatever, it's fine. <laughs> Like, the people I don't like are what? Like, Cameron, uh, Red, Bowie Jane. 
Uh, blue to an extent. Obviously, Jared. All right, let's try not to fuck this up. Okay, that was kind of close, but still got it. Uh, yeah. By the way, also a confessional from like three weeks ago. <laughs> because that that was from the Felicia segment, which that Felicia segment was literally week one. Uh, and like you could tell the Sari confessional that was in that segment was filmed week one. So like I'm pretty sure. Uh, even the Bowie Jane one is probably week one as well. Yeah. This is bad, dude. This this runs shit. <laughs> I'm plus five point four. I still don't know how I should be doing this section. Yeah, I I mean Corey and America are my favorite people on this cast. Uh, excuse me? What? Okay, what the fuck? Why'd that one detect me? Actually, at this point, it's like, fuck it, right? Yeah, okay, whatever. I, yeah, I'll, I'll just start over. This run the shit anyway. Um, whatever, I'll practice this, actually. Because I, I know there's, like, I've done this faster than, like, what I've been doing recently. So it's like, what should the strap be? Use the Molotov? Let's see. Like, I know, like, the world record does something with the Molotov, right? I'm pretty sure it just runs, doesn't it? And that's not going to work. I'm pretty sure it just runs and uses the Molotov or something. Um, yeah, like the Cory America relationship, I think, is like probably the like storyline I'm like the most invested in this season for some reason. Um, or again, I, I just think it's, like, a fun relationship. Like, it's, like, a showmance that isn't, like, obviously, like, to the Jared and Blue levels of, like, kind of the, like, you know, the not likable showmance. Um, but you also have them being, like, massive fans and through that, like, their conversations are kind of interesting. With, especially with them, like, making references to Big Brother history here and there. That's not gonna work, right? Yeah, that was kind of close, though. Uh, side to day, you don't really care about Starfield. Yeah, I don't know. I'm... To be honest, like, the, the fact that there's, like, this, like, uh, like, group of people that are so upset, like, how dirty make us have to pick our pronouns. Like, that kind of makes me want to play it more. <laughs> Just because it's, like, uh, it's getting, like, all this, like, uh, idiotic criticism. Um... But, realistically, I, yeah, I probably won't end up playing it. I think that'll end up working. No, I won't. Oh, it did. I think that was too late. I think it's rape. Oh, no, it isn't. Okay. Is that what she'd do, then? That would be pretty good. Oh, wait, the, the fuck, the clicker's right there. Duh. See, I don't give a shit about the story of Starfield. Um, like, I'm sure I would if I, like, got around to playing it. But, like, as of right now, like, I, I don't even give a shit enough to look up spoilers. <laughs> nah, that's not worth doing. <laughs> um, hmm. <laughs> Where the fuck the clicker go? I was waiting for the clicker to show up. Um, I feel like Corey played too young. I, I agree with that. Yeah, I think... It, I saw someone post that, like, oh, if he played, like, seven years later, he would probably be, like, Kevin Jacobs. And I, I probably agree with that sentiment for the most part. Okay, whatever. How'd they not pick up the Molotov? Uh... 
Actually, you know what? I think I'll just still do it slowly. I think I'll just, like, change up how I do it slowly. <laughs> See, it scratches the Mass Effect itch. I don't feel like it would, if I were to guess. At least to me, it, it just looks like like Fallout in space. More so than anything like Mass Effect E. Oh, <laughs> that was just me being dumb. I hit run too early. Oh yeah, I forgot, yeah, there you can play in third or first person, right? Which I guess that's like most Bethesda games. But yeah, I think if I were to play, I'd probably play in third. Damn. I'm gonna get caught, aren't I? Yeah. Biggest thing with the game is the concept of exploring what's out there. Yeah, I think that was, like, my initial thing. But, like, it sounds like the exploration of the game is, like, really underwhelming. Based on what I've been hearing. Which kind of, like, makes this, like, what's the point of the game? <laughs> um, so, like, supposedly it's, like, a lot more limited than you would have expected it to be. That would be good enough. Yeah. Whatever. I, I guess I'll do another run. Um, you need to get through and backlog. Yeah, I would love to play those games too. I sh yeah, I still don't really have the time. Uh, I think the next game that I'll start whenever I get around to starting another game will be uh, Resident Evil 4. But I don't even know when that will be. Um, like, to be fair, technically I have time now to actually play if I really wanted to. But also, I want to finish Survivor Quebec. Because, like, I've been watching this for almost two weeks now, and I just want to be over with. <laughs> um, yeah, I still need to play Hogwarts Legacy, too. I have that, too. Then what else? I have other games. Dead Space Remake. All right. I have that. Uh, like Dragon Ishin. I did buy that. Uh, but then again, uh, Assassin's Creed Mirage is only a month away. And so is the Survivor video game that we still have any fucking footage from that I pre-ordered. Like, that that thing's almost here, too. And then what? Like, a month and a half from now, Spider-Man? Uh, after Dry Survivor, play for Spoken. For Spoken, I think, is better than than most people claim it's not good like it's still not like yeah it's still not actually good but like um it's definitely not like a game with like no merit to it or anything especially like by the end i think the like back portions of the game are definitely better than the uh early game that was actually gold 31 right that worked yeah, I'll, I'll play it on my own first, just because I want to have footage for it right away to make the video. But Shit. after that, I think we'll probably do at least one stream of it. God. Depending on what it, the thing is, we don't even know what it is. <laughs> That's the issue. Um, but either way, I'll probably stream it at least once. Um, like we don't even know if it's like, like fully multiplayer. We don't know if it's like. Yeah, if it actually has like some sort of single player of any sort or, or what, but we'll we'll just we'll see how it goes. God damn it! Bumped into the thing. I lost two seconds from that too. God damn.
I think that would be a fun way to do it. Let's play with the, with the chat. Dang it, how would we actually do that, though? Because wasn't that kind of like... Uh, I guess I would like take you by your word that you're not actually watching the video or something. <laughs> I don't even know how that would work. Um, but either way. Funky movement. Here we go. How am I losing so much time in those splits? I, I really don't know. I had like a gold first split. Yeah, then after I just like lost what three seconds in the in the next two splits. Whatever. That was close, huh? Yeah, I doubt it will, right? I'm like a game with like this small of a budget, Thanks. I doubt they'll have crossplay on it. Well, come on, up we go. Really, how many people are even going to be playing this on PS5? So, how did you find them? Uh, because that's why I pre-ordered it for. Yeah. <laughs> Remember that firefly you bit and stole his gun? Uh, I'm getting a physical yeah, PS5 I mean, copy because Trevor. obviously I, I need that. I saw him walking down the street, so I tailed his ass. I follow him into this alley, and all these fireflies. Um, excuse me. They took me like, right why'd she not go in? To Marlene. Were you scared? Terrified. Oh my gosh, she's like barely moving. Okay, cool. Me. But instead, she just says, "What took you so long?" Oh yeah, it is on Switch she too, right? What is it? it? What is it all on? Is she it just, just uh, PlayStation, Something Xbox, like Switch, PC? That whole like, is on at all of them. Thing was a test. She wanted to know I was committed. Oh. Okay, it wouldn't let me move there right away. That was a bit of a worry. Oh, yeah, I can't wait for the Game of the Year edition, too. Uh, oh my god, dude, this is so bad. <laughs> oh, whatever. 30 days, my ass. People are getting infected all the time. They just do a good job of hiding. Oh, I actually got... Oh, fuck off! I almost got ahead of her. <laughs> Initiation, Which, like, I'm supposed to be ahead of her. <laughs> oh, shit. I lost almost five seconds there. Oh, whatever. No, this is a new run, but it's a terrible one. Sorry. I'm a bit jumpy lately. Careful, it's wet. Oh my god, so, did they get- oh my- oh. <laughs> Maybe I should try the fire. <sighs> really? You know what? No, I, I'm resetting this. That's- that's bad. What the fuck? Um. Okay. Actually, I forgot I did want to change the settings, didn't I? Because... Uh, change the... A timer looks, which bothers me now. All right, there we go. Uh, Final Fantasy leaks. I haven't seen any leaks. If they were today, oh wait, wrong thing. <laughs> uh, I did see uh, FF16 got two DLCs announced, which. Kind of conflicted on what I think of that. Um, like I think it's cool because I love FF16, but it's also like not because uh, I feel like the story's done. And I don't know what else they need to tell. Um, like especially like I hope it's not after the the events of the story. Um, All right, now where the fuck do I go? But also, it's like if it's not after, and it's also like I don't know like kind of what's the point but it's also like the ending is like like left ambiguous in the way that it's like i feel like if you wrap that up it kind of like lessens the story i'll click on that in a second Maybe he's got something on him. 
Oh, I just realized, is this the, um, the one that, oh, fuck, okay, no, we're restarting this anyway. <laughs> um, oh, pff, wrong one, I'm in menu. Oh, right, well, I'll read this in a second. Um, is this the one that is, uh, like, has rebirth in it? Because I think I saw that. That, like, someone leaked something about rebirth. Um... But it was, like, also, like, nothing. But, all right, let's see. Um, uh, another Sonic game coming next year. Now, is that why I believe? Oh, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, I'm a Hero 2. That's what the, the source is. Which, yeah, I know that's, like, a, like, a new source that got, like, one thing right, right? And now they're, like, claiming a whole bunch of other stuff. But, anyway, um... Persona 6 is a bit further away than last time I updated. I mean, that's not shocking. Um, main theme of Persona 6 is black and white. What does that even mean? Um, or are you talking about like, just the colors? <laughs> or black and white? Um, a party game for Persona? That's something. Um, FF9 remake was summer 2024. Not sure about that anymore. Uh, that's, yeah, reasonable. Uh, remake 2, since so I'm a new protagonist for part 3. I mean, like, yeah. <laughs> okay, I think this is why I saw, but it's also, like, nothing, right? <laughs> because, like, okay, if you know FF7, then, like, you know where part 2 is going to end. And through that, you know where part 3 is going to start. Which, like, you know that it's going to start with a new character. Or not a new character, but, like, a different character than the one you're typically playing as. So it's like, I feel like that's... Like, if this is true, that would be what that is implying. Um, I don't think it's, like, a brand new character entirely. Um, but anyway. Uh, 10 Remake and 10-3 has a skeleton crew. Not making anniversary. Yeah, I did see that, too. Um, which... 10 remake fine i mean i still haven't played the remaster uh that i've owned for a while but i wouldn't be opposed to playing remake uh especially to make it like action oriented and everything um 10 3 it's like uh, do people really want 10 3 <laughs> by the way um square's new ps5 dev kits that's whatever uh 7 remake looks and runs like a ps5 game on switch 2 that's interesting. Yeah. So kind of nothing big. Kind of like I've seen like a lot of that actually, but I just kind of forgot about it. But anyway, uh, genius deathmatch themed. Uh, you know this. That. I mean, she'll at least be the main character for first like bit of it, right? Okay, spoiler for Final Fantasy VII. Like, it's 100% editing at the Northern Crater, right? So through that... Um, okay, cool. <laughs> Ready, set, go. Um, yeah, through that, yeah. Like, part three is going to start Tifa. Um, and you're going to play as hers for, uh, for bits. I'm assuming they're probably going to expand things considering for part three in particular, considering... Um, like, there's not that, that much that needs to happen in part three. From, like, a base plot perspective of seven to where obviously like zach stuff is gonna probably like come to a head there too um and that's gonna like also add a lot to the to the story but yeah i'm assuming we are gonna be playing as tifa for a decent chunk Maybe he's got something on him. Uh, that is unless they kill her in part two. <laughs> uh, which I don't think is going to happen. Because I know some people do believe that they're going to kill Tifa instead of Aerith. But I really don't think they're going to. 35 right, 3 left, 31 right. That worked. <laughs> I mean, like, they're, like, uh, was it Ever Crisis, right? They're, like, doing Shit. more Sephiroth there. God. Oh, man. 
so I wouldn't be surprised. That's like set up for things that are gonna happen in Rebirth. They're gonna expand Sephiroth's role and everything, or not Rebirth. Well, I guess Rebirth and Part Three. Oh Damn god. It. Okay, cool. Whatever. Okay, cool. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Uh it's stupid. Alright, try this again. This is what attempt number six <laughs> of the night in what forty minutes? So that's great. Um uh, Dirge. Um yeah, I don't know what they're going to do with Dirge. I, I know they did an interview, um, fucking, was it Katase? One of the, like, people in charge of 7 Re Remake. Um, that they said that they're not going to do Dirge until after the trilogy is done. To where, like, I, or I should clarify. They said that if they're going to remake Dirge, uh, or remaster it in the way they did for, like, Crisis Core, they're not going to do it until after, re uh, the trilogy is done. Uh, which... Like, I mean, if they're redoing Dirge, they gotta they gotta redo a lot, <laughs> don't they? Um, to us, they probably just sh shouldn't remake Dirge. That'd probably be better off. It is funny though that like FF Seven um, is obviously like the masterpiece it is, but then. They decided to not make anything FF7 related until fucking Dirge of Cerberus, uh, like seven years later or whatever, or eight years later, whatever it is. It's funny how like they thought, oh, Dirge of Cerberus, this is the good, the thing that's good enough to be the successor to, to Final Fantasy VII. Right. Three left, thirty-one right. That well, also, it's looking pretty good for a uh, One Piece season two. <laughs> Which, again, I'll be really interested in. Shit. Uh, by the way, One Piece review comes out tomorrow for anyone that cares, God, yeah. which is way too long. Come to life. Come um, to life. Nothing. Like it's a, uh, almost an hour long. Even that's after like cutting out like a whole bunch of stuff. Okay. Oh, fuck. I kind of regret not rereading yeah. the manga though, before. All right. The series came out. Promise well, I think in retrospect, I would have um, reread at least the East Blue saga. Okay, better than last time. No. Great beer arc. I mean, oh, isn't, oh, like, they have the, um... It's gotta have something. I forgot the play. Where, where's Barrett from? The, mm -hmm. like, the stuff that happens there? Like, that's gonna happen in Rebirth, right? Like, Rebirth, like, has to be, like, such a massive game, right? Like, if they are gonna all, get all the way to Northern Crater, like, that's so much content. Here we go. Right. Hurry. Up here. I think this is the best run of the night. Uh, oh, wait, we only got one to this point, didn't we? Never mind. I was for some reason think we got more than that. But anyway, I mean, it is the best run of the night either way so far. Um, that was close, huh? Why do you see... There. I've never seen anything Big Brother Nigeria without, like, looking up Thanks. specific things. Like, without... Uh, oh, Marvin was on go. Big Brother Nigeria, right? I think that's the only time I've seen Big so, Brother Nigeria how stuff. How did you find them? The fireflies? Oh, yeah. Yeah, did that? Was that since last stream? I remember that firefly? You or was that like, was uh, was that yeah. this morning or was that yesterday? That's but yeah, Trevor. BBUK has I a premiere date now, down the street, so I which, uh, yeah, I October eighth, right? All these fireflies ambush me. I'll probably watch it. I don't know. It's, it's going to be a lot, though. Um, Were you but I'll, I'll probably watch it. Fuck off, Riley. Continue walking. I thought this time she would actually shoot me. But instead, she uh, by the way, I also, uh, I believe you have, like, a rumored me. Traders Canada release date as well. Something which that's like not that? confirmed. That whole almost killing me thing was a test. But um, I she believe it's rumored to be September 25th. Oh. Which is the Monday before Survivor starts, which... 
obviously that's great to add another show uh, at that point. I mean, at least by that point, NZ and AU will both be done, but still. Fuck you, Riley. By the way, my split is literally called Fuck You, Riley. Um, and then the uh, 30 days, my ass. following her at the end of the chapter is called Fuck You, Riley again. Oh, fuck off. I almost got ahead of her. Initiation, they actually made me kill this oh, yeah, Devil's Plan comes out too. Fuck me, dude. Oh, shit. Hi. Yeah, again, there's just too many shows. Uh, but I think I've decided now that I didn't mention this before that once I finish Trace or Trace Quebec, uh, Survivor Quebec, that. Uh, I was thinking of, like, maybe I'll watch some other shows before, yeah, like, fine. continuing off the shows that I need for videos. I think I've decided down. I'm just going to watch the maybe things I the that I need for videos. Just get them out of the way. I'd rather just do that and then, at that point, just, like, be able to watch things cool. freely. Uh, more so than feeling like, okay, I need to rush through this so that I can get back on uh, track and everything. So yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll finish Survivor Quebec, and then I'll end up watching, what, Troll Drama Action? Is it a dinosaur? And then BB-5, and then Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Season 2. Uh, and then after that, I'm free uh, in terms of shows I'm doing videos on. I, I don't know if this is even worth it when she's already, like, pretty much ahead of me. I can't believe Winston's gone. You heard? Liza P. I'm definitely not going to play happened? Liza P. Um, yeah, okay, I'm not big into Soulsborne sort of games. I don't know. So, I would suspect I wouldn't like it, but really. Okay, I was worried that was a little bit too early. Ellie. Yeah, this is something I don't understand with, like, Smoker. Like, I, I was actually under the, under the assumption when watching Season 1 that, oh, are they just going to, like, cut Smoker out? And, like, Garp is just getting the Smoker content? But then, no. Like, Garp is, like, probably gone now for a bit. And then, uh, fucking Smoker's going to be uh, in Season 2 anyway. Yeah, so it's like, are we just going to do the same thing again? Because it's essentially just the same thing. <laughs> Uh, just without the aspect of it being his grandfather. See, I don't know what they're doing there. Like, really, so much of, like, season one, like, feels like they didn't even think they would get a season, like, two or three or whatever. For, I, mean, I guess there's, like, points where they, like, mention Baroque works and stuff like that. But, like, you can definitely tell, like, there's, like, things that are added there that, like, make it seem like they don't even think they'll get to, like, Skypea. Uh, and stuff like that. Blackbeard. Come on, I got um, could we get a cameo of that in season two? Blackbeard's first appearance of what in Jaya, right? Which you would assume would be season three. Put it on. But I guess we could possibly get a cameo in season two. So stupid. Yeah, so like season two, like I feel like it's yeah, pretty easy to outline, ass. right? Um, no we're like episode one's gonna be Logtown, episode two probably Reverse Mountain, episode three Whiskey Peak, Roar. episode four. Ellie. Really? Uh, Fucking roar. Little Garden, right? Um, maybe episode five as well. Don't roar! really. Does that need two episodes? I don't even know. Um, there she is. Oh, too well, early. Let's see what else this place has. Right, I'm plus one point seven still, but whatever. Did he make an appearance in in Drum Island though? Yeah. Oh, you mean he went through Drum? Oh yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. So he was, yeah, he was there earlier. So maybe they could they do like a flashback of like them talking through like what Blackbeard did and then show Blackbeard there, or just in general, just like again he'll be referred to at least. So yeah, I guess yeah he could be. Um, he could have a cameo at least by then. Oh fuck off! Completely uh. The same that. It. Yeah, you like that? Oh my god. Alright! Okay. It's goodish so far. Damn it. Boosh! Yeah! Yeah! Ha! 
All right, let's not miss it this time. That'll be cool. All right, there we go. That was a gold too. That was even that good. Uh, minus twelve now. So that's something. All right, question time. Hey, Dave. Yeah, it's been a while. Okay. You think you'd be more prominent during Big Brother season? You know what? Um. Forget it. You're off the hook. Wow. Okay. Come on. Let me show you this thing. We're almost there. Um. Well, you mean like Kobe and like Helmeppo, Garp? Like they're like really prominent in the live action show for some reason. Um. It's like I mean the Kobe of it all. I actually like I like it for the most part. Um, what are we doing here? The Garp of it all, I I do find yeah. weird though. So, I still don't love Garp you know being there. Like certain areas of the um, yeah. But I kind I do like um, the like the parallels between Kobe and and Luffy, and like how they utilize that to kind of wrap up the season pretty well. Well, I think that's like something I do really respect from the so, TV show is that it very much feels like a season of television. But they do like a lot to like really connect like a, a lot of the uh, a lot of the arcs no together, where like obviously in the original One Piece, it's like like usually once the arc is finished, it's like a lot of what happened in the previous arc doesn't really matter as much. Um, okay, just making sure I didn't do that too early. Um, and like, there's not like as much foreshadowing for the short term, especially early on. Where, um, I feel like you know they did that trying. pretty well in the show. Of, like, having Arlong be involved throughout the entire thing. And, um... I'm really glad that you're not dead. And making, like, references here and there. I mean, that'll be... Uh... I'm glad that we're like, like, having, like, Kuro be mentioned mean, at the beginning of Season 1. Again, paying off the, uh, good pirate stuff. line by the time of the finale. I didn't mean any of it. No memory of this man? Which man are you talking Please. about? You're such a sap. <laughs> Bet you started it. Uh, how do I like jag? It's not looking good. <laughs> um, which, yeah. That's a shame. Are you kidding? I'll second and a half. Whatever, I'm still minus 10. Yeah, like if you're talking about Garp, he doesn't appear in the manga at that point until he is on like some cover pages. Which is why I find it weird they bothered to introduce him so early in the in the series. Never heard of Suri? How have you never heard of Suri? Like, Suri is, like, such... I, I think, like, the... Jesus. Like, watching BB25 now has made me, like, kind of appreciate Suri even more, to be honest. Like, even though, like, obviously, yeah, she's, like, a messy player and all that stuff, and people are calling her out for that. I think it's appreciating me more in the sense that I think it's, like, really solidified, like, her strengths. Uh, to where we see, like, just how good she is socially. Um, and how most of the time that kind of, like, negates her, like, flaws strategically. That was slow. Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, empty. Maybe I can find some. <laughs> Jack is such a good player. He got voted out unanimously and still stayed. Yeah. And then the same people that saved them are the same people that want to get rid of him this week. So what? A, what a great player. Kind of okay, surprisingly. Is that it? Yeah, sounds like it. Okay, find some gas. Mm, come on. That was a cold, huh? Ah, jackpot. Uh, Maria wanted to rule all this. planets because they had some kind of resource. No. Siphon it out, right? That's 
not what it is. Uh, we go? Uh, really at all. Um, it has nothing to do with resources or anything. I right. should do it. I thought we were talking about Don Krieg. Don Krieg's oh. barely in the show. <laughs> Which is, like, funny, because I mean, he's, like, a major villain, and, like, he's pretty much the main villain of the Bratty arc, and... In the, uh, manga, yet they just, like, completely take on the show, which I actually think was for better. Like, Don Creek kind of sucks anyway. Um... And I think, like, taking his spot and using it to, like, further develop Arlong is probably for the better anyway. Electric water. Got it. You skip through most of Barate arc? That's probably the best arc up to that point. Alright, let's see how this goes. Easy. I've lost runs from like falling off the vents before. Gonna be fine. I almost fell off the truck there too. Is that something? Did I not use the brick? Uh, I mean, Felicia's HOH was never going to backfire. <laughs> because by the time she was HOH, like, that was already the contestant's target anyway. Uh, that should not have worked. This might not actually work. Nope, it won't. Cool. I didn't think it would. Uh, so that's some time lost. Uh, I mean, the funny thing is that Felicia's HOH is, uh, debatably the best HOH of the season. <laughs> Bad. I'm breaking even. I was minus 13, and now I'm breaking even. Okay, cool. That happened. All right, so that just ruined this run. And the thing is, I don't want just the PB. I'm mean, like, I'll take a PB, whatever. But like, um, I feel like I would at least want a sub like thirty-two, thirty or so. Yeah, this is really bad. I'm plus four now. What if Camera Red win out? They're not going to, and also they're not even working together anymore anyway. God damn it. Like if Red wins out, then probably Cam's out next anyway. Um Yeah, it's gonna be weird too how that's gonna work with like One Piece where like obviously characters show up like way before they're ever relevant. So it's like, are they really going to have to cast these people, like, way beforehand? Tomorrow you go outside? Well, that's good, right? Um, yeah, tomorrow's Labor Day, right? So that's nothing. I'm not doing anything. <laughs> plus four. Are you ready? Um, Talk. is Matt that good socially? I think he's like fine socially. Like, I, I don't think he's like the greatest social player in the world. I think he's like largely like affable, but I don't think he's like, like a master at his, like a, like a master socially or anything. I don't even pay attention yet. Like, what's open on Labor Day and what isn't? I didn't even think about that. No 
fucking way. I told you. No. Don't tell me it's busted. It's busted. <sighs> Man, for a second I thought I was gonna play it. Yeah, I don't know how much of that is like due to his like real social game that like, he's grouped in so many people. Because it's like he has the group that he was with at the beginning of like sure. Jag and Blue and whatnot. Do it. Um, which, like, a lot of that comes down to the fact that he's, like, Use this, this athletic, bro -y guy they Punch. wanted for comps Use and stuff. Um, and also, like, obviously he did Bond with, like, First, Riley and Jag and whatnot. Um, but then, like, with the Sari side things, it's like, yeah, he's bonding with Sari, but, like, everyone bonds with Sari. Um, and, like, yeah, he's, like, Sari wants to take him far now, but that's because he's, like, a loyal soldier. <laughs> um, it's not because, like, his social ability that makes Sari want to keep him. It's the fact that, it, like, he's, like, very passive strategically that makes Sari want to keep him. Um, and, like, it's through his connection with Sari that I feel like has, like, led to him being, like, well ingratiated with, like, other people. He's super ripped white dude with three arms. He's out. Your oh yeah, he is like the a fine player, but I don't think he's like that great. <laughs> he's like he's pretty well positioned right now, though. Round one starts. Black Fang At least for short term. I think by the time of like final eight or so, Jump up. he'll probably be targeted. There, he overshot you. You land behind him quickly. Punch him in the back. You nailed him with a wicked elbow, taking off like fifteen percent of his health. Yes. He spins around wins out. Oh, red wins out. I hope he doesn't. I hope he goes home this week. Why do you like red? <laughs> like, red is probably my least favorite person in the house. Like, I think I even like Cameron more than I like red. Hit up, block, and kick for a blade change. Block him! You got it! Down, forward, punch for a special move. Oh fuck, I'm in our block. That could have been better. Your time here's done. At least like Cameron I find like kind of funny at points. Like th it's through him being like so awkward and everything. But like I at least find like him kind of funny. I have like n like I get nothing from Red. Kind of and he's also up. icky in the he way that Cameron is. And he, uh, and he also oh, isn't even but, playing the game. At least Cameron's still, playing the game. He's playing it terribly, but at least he's playing. Like, Red's not even yes. really playing. Um, I lost time there. The Fuck. Riley. Riley. Yeah, at least Cameron like recognized that. Okay, we gotta go after Sari at some point. Like all that stuff. Like fucking Red is like uh, like leaking all of his information to Sari. Fuck off. Don't get too comfortable now. In your face! Oh, you're gonna pay for that. Oh, you're gonna pay for that. Oh, what? Oh, actually one? destroyed you. I told you. I rarely win that, to be honest. It's faster to win. I almost never win. You are delusional. Okay. All right. You count to five. Nurkas have a crazy step. beard. I mean, gets hit first, yeah, Donnie is fine. Okay. It's probably the only like Close your eyes. fine one, right? I mean, who else has like a really big beard? And it's like, I guess Paul the first time around Four. was fine. Even th I mean, even then though, like there were some icky moments though. We're back to being minus. Whatever that's worth. Just go Is that buying the easiest game to speedrun? No. One, because the two, end of the game is like really difficult. Three, um, four, five. Time to die. Time to die. Like easiest game would be like Life is Strange True Colors. That's the easiest game I've speedrun. Like, I think any of the, like, graphic adventure games would be, like, really easy. Wow. Okay, you know what? You got lucky. Like, we're about to get to the point where the game gets difficult. <laughs> Wanna go again? Uh. I... I do. I just... Yeah, I see Anthony Caliber still grinding any percent, which... 
yeah. yeah. Okay. I I would never bother doing any percent. Okay. A former okay. world record holder. Yeah, I was a former world record holder of a fucking Life is Strange True Colors. What a great yes. record to have. Come on, let me get my backpack. But the thing is, like, nothing's... Like, you don't have to actually memorize them. You can have a list of them in front of you. You, you have, like, a document in front of you of, like, all the dialogue options you have to pick. Joel! Where again, the final fight in Left Behind is probably the most difficult fight in all of Last of Us. Where, like, again, you're playing as Ellie and you have to take out, like, what? Like, over 20 enemies? Including, also, like, a, a batch of infected? Like, I think final fight in Left Behind is, like, easily, like, the most difficult fight in the entire series. Used to have the high score in a Survivor Trivia oh, app. That's something. What the hell are we doing? Who made a Survivor here? Trivia app? Fuck about that old man and a little girl. The sooner we find them, the sooner we get out of here. Make sure this area. No, I did it again. I did that before too. Oh, uh, whatever. It's fine. <laughs> uh, we're like. I hold triangle for too long to where he ends up stabbing the guy instead of just picking up the arrows. I don't even need the arrows to be honest. Like that that's just like really dumb time loss. But whatever. That was a bit rough, dude. That was way slower than uh like I almost got caught there, but we're fine. Oh, fuck off. Really? I got stuck on that? Well, yeah, I assume it wasn't, like, an official one, but, uh, like, who ended up making it, though? What was that? There she is! Oh, fuck. fuck. You know what? Fuck it. I don't know why I just fought that guy. Cool. This is a disaster. What the fuck? Yeah, we, we have to restart that. I mean, the run's pretty much dead at this point, but whatever. Should I do this? I don't know. What should I do here? What was that? Hey, what'd you guys find outside? <laughs> that did not do much. Well, that was bad. He's climbing back up, isn't he? I'm plus 23! <laughs> uh, fuck me, dude. Fuck this game. I have no health, either. Okay, game? I'm trying to hold it. God damn it! Are they? Where the fuck are they? Okay, cool. Obviously, really bad, but I've never done this well, so I guess it's like. I'm gonna die. He's having no health. 
Or maybe not. Wow, I don't know how the fuck I survived that. Is there still someone left? Oh no, there's someone. Okay. Plus 32. I'm so dead. Oh, I have no ammo too. Cool. <laughs> Whatever. Uh. Okay, we'll see what happens to the drag. It's way too early to tell, but more than likely. Fuck off. Wait, where'd the fucking rifle go? Oh wait, did that guy not die earlier? God damn it. Ah. If I could only get to the point where the infected come out, that actually would have been okay. Because now I have to start the entire fight all over, which Yeah, it's pretty much over. Not completely. Okay, cool. I, I thought he was dead. Like, I really just need to get to the point where there's the other checkpoint. And then it's fine. Fuck off. And to be honest, I'm probably not going to be live for that much longer either. I'll probably do one more attempt, and then that'll probably be it. But yeah, this run's dead. I mean, it was, it was dead a while ago, but like, this is like completely dead. Do I bother finishing this? I don't know if it's worth it. I guess we'll finish the fight, why not? I, okay, I, 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 guess, I guess that's a thing. <laughs> like, what? Well, whatever. <laughs> like, what was that? Um... <laughs> Playing this run and left behind speedrun draft. Obviously, we're going to draft that at some point. But again, this is like a weird like part of the game where like for some reason the checkpoint like counts. Like, once the infected spawn in, the checkpoint counts, uh, like, after every enemy is killed, meaning that, like, when you restart, it only starts with, like, what you had left, so, like, dying actually isn't that bad at that point. Um. Fuck. I mean, this would have been bad even if I, if I, even if I didn't die and everything. Is that it? So I think that's the point where I restart encounter. Yeah, okay. Better be alive, Joel. Wait, let's see. Alright, I'm plus two minutes in a second, so I lost a minute and a half there. Alright, yeah, there's no point in even finishing this. Um yeah, that was bad. Jack's offering himself up to be pawn. That's funny. Doesn't really matter though. He's still like he was gonna go up anyway. Um, okay, we'll do one more attempt and that'll be it. It's kind of disappointing. I didn't even get a PB though. If I don't get it here, but oh well. Yeah, Matt volunteered earlier. But like, if Matt goes up, I think he's pretty safe. I don't think they'll flip the boat him out. But Jag is. Definitely not. That's all I got this. All right. Now where the fuck do I go? Like really, like with this run, I really just need to get to the final fight, like pretty much even. And then at that point I could still PB. Oh, shit. But I always like get like 
I always like fuck up the final encounter before the final fight. Yeah, I, th I think I even though Jag has played this still terribly, like I still think there's like some potential in him. Um, like I think it would be interesting to see him play in a cast that doesn't have Suri in it. Um, but like if he does go home here, like I might have to end up putting him lower than I even expected on the uh, player ranking. I'm gonna go ba out back to back. Even though too far, he got pretty unlucky this time around. Where, um, like, really, if Cam didn't you win Vito, uh, he was pretty much lock safe. And even then, like, it's not even like it's like guaranteed that Jack goes home. Um, and also, there's like been a whole bunch of discussion on like, is it America? Is it Jag? Is it um, Red? Now we take out. It's not like. Like he was like dead to rights or anything, but it is like really frustrating though to watch Jag play. To like he had it like all figured out on Friday, and then like just all of a sudden it's fucking gone. That was a goal. Interesting. I, I said this earlier, I think America is the actual, like, should be the target for the Suri side of things. Oh. A military helicopter. That's gotta have something. But, um. There, yeah, it seems like Suri and, like, Felicia want to work with America. Or at least don't want to target her right away, I should say. Not really want to work for that much. I mean, Felicia seems to be, like, very pro-woman, right? To where, like, I think she wants to keep around America because of that. But, um... Here we go. Okay, that was bad. Actually, this is better than the last run. By point one second. For whatever that's worth. I mean, that's also a two-way street that America doesn't talk game this or either. But, yeah. There. I mean, America, like, was the person that, like, Sri just did not have a relationship with for a while. Well, come on. Like, Sri yeah. essentially had a relationship with every single person in the house outside so, of America. How did you find them? Um, the Fireflies? And it wasn't until yeah. Heisem was going out that she finally that made, like, some sort of deal with America. Yeah, I remember him. That's Trevor. But, like, to be honest, I feel like that's more on America, though, than Suri. Or, like, Suri doesn't need America. America needs Suri way more than Suri needs America. Were you scared? Terrified. I thought this time she Fuck off, Riley. Fucking move. But instead, she just says, What took you so long? Jesus. Corey's a smart version of Jason Siska in what way? How is he anything like close to Jason Siska? That whole almost killing me thing was a test. Like, if anything, Jared is more like Jason Siska. Oh. Than, uh, than Corey is. I mean, I don't even think... That's not even a good comparison. Is Eliza and... And Jason to Corey in America. I don't even think, like, who would be the comparison, though, for America, for Suri, in, like, her survivor career? What? You know, now I'm I'm restarting. I, I'm I lost ten seconds in that split. How the fuck I? Lose? Oh wait, wrong thing. How did I lose ten seconds? Like I knew she was bad. I didn't realize she was that bad. Um. All right, we'll do one more. Uh, is Jag Jason Siska? Yeah, I think Red might be the better Jason Siska or Cameron. Probably Cameron, to be honest. Cameron's probably the one. 
Um, I mean, supposedly Cameron right. had watched yeah, fuck, that, right? I think was the reason why that, yeah, she was like, I can't be the one to do it is because like Cameron had watched uh, Survivor to where he would at least know that, even though he didn't, I don't think he knew who Sri was. <laughs> um, but yeah, like he knew of the, the Eric Rankenback move. I think he didn't know that it was Sari that did it, though. <laughs> Pharmacist. He's like, he also watched the traitors, right? And he still didn't recognize Sari. Wasn't that also a thing? Or at least he knew of the traitors. Maybe, maybe he didn't watch it. But, like, I know he, like, referred to the traitors. That's, like, part of why Sari, like, didn't trust Cameron. Is because she thought that he might know more about her than what he actually does. 35 right. 3 left. 31 right. Do I just agree to potentially be a pawn if that's what the group decides? I mean, that, that's pretty much what they're going to do then, right? Is just tell him that, yeah, you're a pawn. And then maybe he will be, maybe he won't. I, mean, I do think, like, between Red and Jag for Suri. I think it's, like, kind of marginal. Um... It probably is better to get rid of Jag, just because Jag is closer to Matt, and through that, it kind of isolates Matt. Uh, while with Red, there's at least more of the friction between Red and Cameron, to where, like, are they really going to come back together? Uh, and also, Red is just such an idiot that he'll probably, like, blindly follow her anyway. Um, okay. We're still on a decent pace. So, like it probably is still better to get rid of Jag over Matt or over um, Red. Oh. But I think if I think if Cameron and Red were not fractured, though, I think I would probably say Red would probably be the better person to get rid of. Just because I think like Cam and Red as a duo is more powerful than Jag in the game. Currently, at least. I'm too fair. I guess, like, Jack has more potential, though, which I guess is also the issue. Um, but, like, currently in the game, Jack really doesn't have much to work with. Um, Here we go. Because he keeps on throwing away these opportunities. Uh, oh, that was actually good. Right. Fuck. Up here. Um, but, yeah, probably either way, it would be better to get rid of Jack, just because, like, Jack could do something, probably, while Red can't. Is Jag better at comps than Red? I don't even think that's necessarily that the case. Well, huh? Like Red literally just beat Jag in the veto that he need that Jag okay. needed to win uh, in week three. Thanks. Well, come on, up we go. So, how did you find them? The fireflies? Yeah. <laughs> remember that firefly you bit and stole his gun? Yeah, I remember him. That's yeah, but, like, Jag's also, like, competing more. Street, so to where, like, there's more, like, I follow him into uh, more evidence to use or whatever. Like, I think they're pretty much the same comp-wise. Right Actually, really, I don't think Jag's even that great at comps, really. Um, Terrified. I thought this time she would actually shoot me. But instead, she just says... What where what? The know? only she was uh, comp he won she was that chicken comp, right? Something Which, like, that was like a that. comp that, like... Again, okay, he was facing off against like Felicia and Corey, like people that, that like weren't gonna win that. Um, he had like his only real competition was what Cameron in that competition. Or is Red in that one? I don't even remember if Red was in that one or not. Fuck me. Fuck Riley. Thirty days, my ass. People are getting. Hey, is he more athletic than Red? Like Red has been holding his own in physical competitions. Oh, okay, that was actually good. I lost time, but like I'm still minus. Funny how we always refer to Jag as a worse version of someone else. Yeah. I initially mean, was the worst version of Herman. 
Uh, now I think we're like a ways off from that. Careful, it's wet. He's like, Herman could at least hold a power structure at a point. Um, like Jag keeps on like making things and like it just never stays together. She wants you safe at that stupid school. I think he is worse than Kaser. I think he probably has more potential than Kaser. But I think as of right now, I would have him ranked lower than Kaser on my all-time player list. What are we doing here, Riley? Is he the Janelle of the season? In what way? A dinosaur? Maybe. I'll be your friend again if it's a dinosaur. He'll just have to wait and see. Yeah, so far this run's actually not that bad. I okay, I should have done that way earlier. I can't believe Winston's gone. You heard? Yeah. Do you know how it happened? Yeah, I would have more faith in Herman, like if they played again than Jag. Oh, cool. That was also maybe me. Ah, that was also me being dumb. There we go. That might be early. Okay, now we're good. Ellie. <laughs> This party. Yeah, this is the last attempt for the night, probably. Which, so far, again, it's you know it's what? going okay. Hey, Riley, until I just split now, and now we're half a second, or plus half a second. But it was going okay until this split. I did I did restart encounter late, the first one, and then I also yeah I fucked up the second one too. So yeah, that's probably what it was. Well, you see anything? Riley? Oh yeah, yeah, I don't even think it's even a good comparison anymore, Herman and Jag. Like, like Jag, her, I mean, Herman was like a lot better than Jag uh, at this Dude, point. It's two times today. <laughs> How the hell did we never find this place? Well, but yeah, like Jag is essentially like Riley, perfect. Like yeah, I mean like similarish to Kaser. I would say worse than the fact that again, Kaser at least like got like something done, um, and actually like something like relatively yeah, difficult to that, be done done, that. in that he pulled like no, entire half the house together uh, to lead the charge against like the, the person uh, that was at the top of the other roar. power structure. Ellie, really? Fucking roar! Jag is more of a moose, kind of. Um, yeah, I mean, I I, should, I think that's like a decent comparison if there Moose got booted relatively early. Now let's see what else this place has. But because Moose uh, made it further, I wouldn't like rank them similarly. Ah, I got an idea. So they're probably like similar like caliber yeah, player. Yeah, red one's yours. I'll be blue. We throw bricks. Whoever breaks all the windows to their car, wins. Are you kidding me? I'm like the brick master. <laughs> all right. Loser has to... Uh, I think they might have saved Moose to no, be an anti-Kyle move still no. at that point. What is this, truth or truth? All right, fool. You're on. Because at that point, it was still like more of an anti-Kyle thing than it was about like who actually yeah. uh, stayed. Fuck. That hit? Okay. Didn't think that was gonna hit. Um. Two down. Ha. Uh -huh. And that's how you do it. Okay. Kind of decent so far. I don't know if that's gonna hit. Yeah, you like okay, that? Okay, good. I need one more brick. Last one. There we go. All right, we're back to being minus minus nine point three. Yeah, whatever, loser. All right, question time. I'm scared. Okay. Um, does Red not benefit anybody's game? You know what? Forget. I think he does benefit Suri no. and Co. Just because he's like wow. okay. such a nothing person in the game. Um, we're almost there. And like he does seem to be like focused on 
Cameron, even if, even if not Cameron, then, like, America. Um, but, yeah, like, no one, like, should be, like, fighting too, too hard for Red, though. What are we doing here? Where, like, you would think that Jag would have, like, Matt and... You know how we thought and Blue, you would think, uh... Yeah. Like, America would have, like, Corey. Follow me. Well, yeah, I don't know who's, like, super fighting hard for Red. I'm trying to get minus a minute, at least. My my so, PB is 33.51. I want to at least get 32.30, probably, <laughs> before I... Like stop doing these. All you gotta do is fix There's no way this is gonna work. If not, like, all right, I mean, maybe a may, sub thirty-three, probably. See, <laughs> so, yeah, probably a minute. Like, will be where like I'm like content enough for now, even though it's still not good. But it's like, I mean, it's, like technically some of best is still thirty-two, thirty-four. But that's also because like I haven't really gotten Wait. good. Splits towards the end of the run. I know what you're trying to do. Just do the BB can player draft tonight. Obviously, we we obviously should. Um, I'm really glad that you're not dead. I mean, red is like a potential weapon I'm glad for Cameron. That we're back together. Um, I didn't mean it. Which yeah, should be a worry. Because I think Cameron literally tells Sari today that like All he's gonna try to repair his relationship with Red or something. Which yeah, that should be a worry. Yeah, I don't love Matt just like constantly throwing America's name out there, <laughs> which is also weird because say like she ha he has a final three oh, with like man. America and Corey. Are you ready? So it's like it's weird that he's like just so openly like throwing America's name out. Are you kidding? Okay, that's fine. Still minus nine seconds. But again, all the time saves at the end of the run. Uh, played a game of Roblox Big Brother. It was actually interesting. Well, that's something. I've still never played Roblox in my entire life. Yeah, I don't know what to think of, like, Corey and America's, like, overall play. Because, like... There's, like, good stuff there. It's just that the people that they're trying to work with, like, they're not, like, on the same wavelength, it seems like. Like, I think they've done, like, pretty good work, like, recently. But, like, that was more so for survival than, like, building up allies. Where, like, when they were, like, obviously, like, trying to build the relationship with Jag, and, like, it seemed like things were on the up for, like, during Friday. Like, um, like, just everything crumbles the following day. And, again, I don't know how much, like to credit them for that, but, like, and, like, how much, like, of that to really, like, have as a knock for Jag. That was a gold. Empty. America's better strategy, Corey's better socially. Probably. I mean, to be honest, I'd probably argue Corey's better at both. It's just that I think, like, his current read on the house is not accurate. Fuck. Well, that's bad. I think that should be the strat. I got no ammo from that. Fuck off. Well, that's not good. Close though. I think that should be the strat. I should just use the brick on the last one. Alright, how do you do this? Instead of trying to kill with ammo. Siphon it out, right? Here we go. Uh yeah, it's gonna be a lot of flip flopping over the next couple days, which is gonna be interesting. Alright. That should do it. He's shared more than Cameron. I mean the thing is like Cameron doesn't, like, treat Corey that poorly, right? It's like, when they're talking, it's like, yeah, there's obviously, it's awkward, because, like, like, he knows what, like, Cameron's doing to America and everything, but, like, Cameron, like, doesn't, like, Cameron clearly, like, likes Corey. 
is just like upset at him for like what's happening with America for whatever. Oh, fuck off, cool. Uh, for whatever reason. Um, there we go. Um, uh, while, um, yeah, like, ja uh, Jared just sucks. Uh, and it's just like on this, like, completely different world strategically than, than Corey. Flip flopping lowers three threat level. Um, I don't think I don't think it really does much at all for three in terms of that. Like I don't think it really harms her that much, but I also don't think it really benefits her. In any way, I think it harms her in the fact that obviously it's just sloppy play. But like in terms of like her perception in the house, I should say I don't think it harms her. I right, was trying not to fuck this up last, uh, this time. I see later biggest party. And we'll probably be done here whenever this run dies. And the thing is, is Corey even next on the totem pole at this point? Like, it seems like the anti Cory sentiment is, like, kind of, um, died down a bit. Oh, I was supposed to split. Yeah, I hear you. Yeah, I'll just go the slow route. Because I just don't feel confident not doing it at this point. Okay. Oh, that was okay. Minus eleven. Uh, it just once we re realizes she's done with Corey, uh, he's gone. I mean, yeah. Wait, what? I've never happened, had that happen to me in my entire life. What? <laughs> like what? Like legitimately what? Like how is this thing so close to me this time? Like this has legitimately never happened in my entire life that I've been killed by this clicker. Why is it coming out so early? Like, I've literally done this twice already tonight. And it didn't kill me. It's coming out so early. Why is it coming out so early? I mean, I, I don't even have the ammo to do anything. Like, okay, this is stupid. Well, that's that. Uh, I guess we're done. <laughs> Fuck that. Uh, like that's ridiculous. Like I've literally never had that in my entire life. Like I've played this DLC like what, like hundreds of times, um, and that's never happened. Uh, whatever. No, what, what else could I do? I'll probably never speedrun the main game ever again. Just because I don't care enough to do it. Um, should I do another run? I'll do one more. Why not? Let you think Izzy wants to take Corey and America deeper? Yeah, I think that's the case. I don't know about America necessarily, but I think Corey at least. But I still think at the end of the day, her goal is to take Suri and Jared. What happened there? Like I, I legitimately have never seen that before. I totally got this. 
Thank you for the bit. Right. A minute. Now where the fuck do I go? Yeah. This will definitely be it, though, considering we're almost at 3 o'clock. Interesting, is he running without Sari? I'll be too. Like, I think it is kind of underwhelming to see, like, is he, like, obviously just playing for Sari. Where it would have been interesting to see, like, like, would she have done the same thing for Jared? I think that is an interesting question. Like, even if just Sari wasn't there, but Jared was still there, like, would she still be, like, fighting this hard just for Jared? Probably not, right? Especially considering, like, they had that fight in week three or whatever it was. Uh, but like at the end of the day, like she's probably like not the greatest player in the grand scheme of things. Oh, she hundred percent recognizes Jared. She recognized Jared before Sri even showed up. Like she was literally telling Jared as they were walking in before they even saw Sri that she knows who he is. And then once they saw Sri, it was like even like doubling down even more. Which, like, I don't know how she knew who she is, who he was. Like, that's weird to me. Because, like, I, would, I wouldn't recognize Jared just from looking at him um, before the Sri of it all. That was cool. Like, according to her, she, like, stalked uh, Sri's Instagram or whatever and, like, knew how, like, knew uh, what all of her kids looked like and all that stuff. It's funny because I believe her Instagram got hacked, right? He's like, uh, uh, like, uh, yeah, her Instagram's like not even like there's barely anything on it anymore. I think it's because like, it got hacked like a year ago or so. But like, it's funny that Sari like knew that anyway, or Sari Izzy knew that anyway. That was bad, by the way. Oh, but would you really recognize the family member? Okay, that wasn't, wasn't right. as bad as I thought, actually. Yeah, hey, would you really recognize, like, a family member of a Survivor player and stuff? Like, I would recognize, like, most Survivor players and, uh, like, Big Brother players and stuff. But I would not recommend, recognize their family members for the most part. I was even looking at a photo of HB recently, and, like, I would not have recognized HB um, nowadays. Oh, come on. We go. So, how did you find them? The fireflies? Yeah. <laughs> Remember that fire? I think she's the glue now. Uh, I do think Izzy and Jared would have worked together early on, though, I even without Suri. So but yeah, I do think like when they had that fight in week three, that probably would have been the point where Izzy All gave up on Jared. Me. They took me right to their hideout. And same thing, probably the other to way around me. too. Were you scared? Terrified. I thought this time she would actually shoot me, but instead yeah, she HB says, "Yeah, HB Sri's husband." Took you so long. Honey Bunny, you don't know Honey Bunny? And she just oh fuck off! Like <laughs> what? Like she went fucking time. She wanted to know I was committed. Oh. All right, let's see how much time this loses. But really, I, I can't even, like, think of, like, what, would there even be a, like, relative that I would recognize that wasn't obviously, like, already a, like, not, like, a blood versus water or something like that, but, like, uh, yeah, like, a relative of the Survivor Big Brother player that I would recognize just improperly. How the fuck did I get ahead of her this time, though? I've actually had worse today. <laughs> I'm only plus two. Uh, so I guess we'll continue. But that was dumb, though. Man, sorry, I'm a bit jumpy lately. Oh, I think Careful, like blue just doesn't care. Hey, so 
Um, like one, I think she's like, well, I don't want to leak Jared's secret because like she actually cares about Jared. Um, uh, I think beyond that, she doesn't look at it as a big deal. I don't think. Um, like I think the fact that we didn't even get like Blue talking about how, like Sari, like how she knows that Sari is Jared's mom, like and how that affects like the um, like how much like she knows that how well insulated Sari is in the game. Like she doesn't even like mention that on tonight's episode. Like I think that's a pretty big sign that. She just doesn't actually again. care. Um, because, like, you hear her response. Like, in the conversation where, where Jared tells her, it's like her response is, like, as if, like, oh, why would you think I would be upset by that? I can't believe There's no way she forgot that. You heard? Yeah. Do you know how it happened? Like, I do think Jag and Blue legitimately forgot that they knew about Legend 25. Really? But, like, there's no way they, like, Blue forgot that Jared's mom is in the game. Oh, it's a bad move no matter what. <laughs> to tell uh, Blue about Suri. I do bear, he, he didn't tell her about Suri technically. I guess he technically did, it's just that she didn't recognize that he did. Oh, fuck off. That was dumb. I still save time. You know what? I'll get you up and over. See if you can unlock it from the inside. Good call. Man, plus 1.4. Well? Okay, no? Like, why the fuck should she turn around? I'm not even holding Riley? a one. Game? Okay, what the fuck? <laughs> Might not take a while to interact. Uh... <laughs> you dick! That's two times today. <laughs> How the hell Jared is like Ty. They both play? test people. I mean, I guess. On, They're I like Marlene. She literally just said that Marlene, a second ago, contact. didn't she? Check it out. Or is that later? I know the initial test is already is. When's the second time she says? So stupid. Um, you know how Marlene is. <laughs> yeah, bad ass. No more. Oh, that's way later, actually, because that's when. Roar. Ellie. Riley really? reveals she's leaving. Fucking right? roar. Sucks none of these moves will affect Jerry in the long run. Yeah. Or again, that's why he's number one in my power ranking. <laughs> uh, because he's probably going to win the season. Oh, forgot to split. That was bad either way, but like, I... Yeah, I definitely didn't lose four seconds. Ah, I got an idea. See those cards down there? Yeah. Red one's yours, I'll be blue. We throw bricks. Whoever breaks all the windows to their car, wins. I think it depends on who Jared's up against. I don't think he's a guaranteed... Winner. Loser has to answer. But I think if he's up against like Izzy, I think he wins. What is this? Truth um, truth? Against Suri, Suri probably wins, right? All right, fool. Unless Suri like literally says like, like give Jared the win, which is not all the wrong possibility. All right. Um. Mm, and that's okay. How you I, do it. Somehow hit. What? Damn. How'd that miss? Ha. Okay, well, she's okay. Well, it's yeah. bad. Ah, fuck. Yeah, I thought that was gonna miss too. Uh, I mean the run's pretty dead. Why did all the fucking bricks go? I'm already losing time. Oh. Where did all the bricks go? What? Go. Uh -huh. where, where did all the bricks go? Okay, this is just stupid. Last one. I mean, there's no point in continuing this. Yes. Bricks. I'm plus 30. Faster. My car had 
tougher window. Yeah, whatever, loser. Josh, Christmas wants right, you, Christmas Josh. I'm sorry. Oh, who votes for Christmas? Uh, okay. Uh, you know what? Nobody? Forget it. Kevin? You're off the hook. I think. Wow. That's probably it. There's no point. Uh, I don't even know why I'm even bothering. Um, that was bad. Oh, well. It is what it is. Oh, should I? Oh, I forgot. There's no encounters thing in this. That's only in Remake. I mean, either way, he wins. I mean, yeah, it's like, technically, he would have won by more if we took Christmas. Um, but it's actually, like, funny where, like, Paul's technically the bigger jury goat than Christmas. Because Christmas would have been Paul. True color speedrun. I don't even have it installed. I did reinstall part one, though. So if I really, really wanted to, we could do part one uh, run. Um... Should I do part one run? <laughs> I mean, like, who fucking cares about, uh... The recording, right? It'll be split into two. Like, the, the stream will end for a second, and then I'll be back. But I kind of want to, to be honest. You know, I technically don't want to stay up to, like, like almost 4 o'clock. But I kind of do want to do it. Because I kind of just want to see how I'll do nowadays. So, yeah, let's do it. Fuck it. Um, so, yeah, I'll be back in a second. I have to... Stop the game, so see you then. <laughs>